Welcome back to OWF11. You are on Intellian TV. We're here with uh, Anthony Wasserman from uh, Carnegie Mellon University, uh, professor of software management practice. Welcome, Annie. Thank you, Bessie. Uh, so, uh, Open World Forum is all about open source. So, uh, so maybe we can uh, we can talk about since you are involved in uh, Carnegie Mellon with all open source. Can you tell us more about what you are actually doing in this department? Sure. Um, we have. Um of course, uh, uh, graduate programs in software engineering and software management in the university. Uh, I have a uh, research group uh, that is uh, involved with uh, evaluation and adoption and use and government of open source. So we don't build any open source software, but we do look at how it's used both um, in the community setting and uh, in businesses, both uh, the commercial open source developers and the uh, adopters. Okay, so uh, maybe we can, uh, talking about open source strategy and uh, how it affects companies, probably especially with smaller companies, how would you say this relates to the entire uh, culture? Sure, well, I, I think that uh, we've seen several things happen over the years, and it's accelerated recently because of the economic downturn. Uh, we've, we've had many of the most successful uh, startups in, in Silicon Valley uh, start with open source software and build on it. Uh, Facebook uses MySQL, uh, Google uh, built from Apache, Yahoo was built on um, OpenBSD. So you have uh, a culture in, in these uh, companies that is, is based very heavily on the use of, of open source software. When you look at startups now, the smaller ones, uh, they're able to deploy in the cloud, they're able to use uh, open source databases and open source components, open source languages uh, for building their applications. And what that means is that they can be very agile, they can start very quickly, and they can focus on the added value of their particular product or service without having to rebuild the infrastructure which open source already provides for them. So, you, so open source is definitely one of the. It's it's it has this culture of open source helps helps companies uh, absolutely evolve and faster. And of course, we've seen a number of companies like MySQL and JBoss and Zimbra that have all been acquired uh, that that built up uh, on a commercial basis, uh, offering offering their software uh, at no charge, and then offering either premium versions for a fee or uh, making their money simply from selling services on it. But it creates a different mentality for, for startups that there's no longer the assumption or the expense of proprietary software and hardware uh, for many of the startups in Silicon Valley. And that, that's uh, an important cultural change. Well, I mean, you yourself have been uh, involved in a startup. I mean, you've run one of the first 100.coms and uh, one of the first, prob uh, the second to release an open source software so can you share a bit more about your experience sure well it goes back away of course being being an early dot com but back in the 80s when i was a, a university of california professor i left to start interactive development environments we built software through pictures it was uh, here in france uh, distributed by a small company called institut de génie logiciel and we then put our european headquarters here in uh, versailles uh, versailles chantier so um, I spent a lot of time uh, here in Paris, uh, but um, uh, so, so we put uh, an open source database uh, at the foundation of our, uh, of our product, and then subsequently I've uh, been in some other startups where uh, open source was an uh, important component of, of our solution uh, before I decided several years ago to uh, go uh, back and take this nice offer in academia. Uh, that's that's quite a journey. Startups, academia, and open source is definitely one of the. It, it has it has followed you in both. Yeah. Adventures. It has, and uh, I hope it will continue to do so. It's um, really quite a change in in the world to see how it has come to play such an important role. Well, thank you very much for your time, Anthony. It's My been a pleasure. pleasure having you here. Good. Thanks again. Have okay. a good time at OWF. Yep. Uh, we'll be soon again on Intellian TV.